Hello everybody and welcome Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Persona 3 Reload. So anyway Today we're just, we're gonna start off by going to talk to Tanaka. Uh that's that is one heck of a way to start off a video, huh? Ay ay ay. Anyway. Here we go. I'm almost certain something's gonna take place on the full moon. The other day, a woman came to my office asking for a donation. Quite the looker, I might add. In fact, she was very much my type. But no matter how attractive she was, I was repulsed by her dedication to charity work. Uh, if I say no, the tabloids are gonna tear me to shreds. Why should I have to give my hard-earned money to a bunch of freeloaders? I pulled myself up out of squalor to get where I am today. I wanted to get back at the ones who used to laugh at me. That's what I always dreamed of, anyway. But, to tell you the truth, now I have too much money. Profits are booming. I'm so busy, I don't have time to spend a yen of it. Maybe? I should train someone to take my place. I could teach them my business philosophy and management techniques. It'd be a carbon copy of me. It would probably cost me a fortune, but if it works, then it's easy living. <laughs> hmm. How would you feel about being adopted? Only joking. People would get funny ideas if I took in a child as old as you. for the sake of the less fortunate, huh? I was about to say, is it going to make me disconnect from the network again? I don't know why I did that. Hi, I guess. What's up? What's wrong? No. You've been off the past few days. What's the matter? Talk to me, woman. Robot thing. Uh, Android? What is I guess? Mitsuru? Question mark. Hey, Mitsi. Where? Where is she? Where is she? Where? Where's? Where? Where? No, nope, stop! 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 Hit all the damn wrong buttons. Anyway, hi Mitsuru, how you doing? Let's go, lady. <laughs> you know, there's not much time left for us to spend like this. In just a short while, we'll be looking back on these days with nostalgia. Since my father passed away, I've been faced with a number of complicated issues. My inheritance, the future of the Kirijo group, and the expectations of everyone involved with both. It's possible I won't be going to college or starting a career. I may need to walk a different path. Say, what does marriage mean to you? Forward answer. However, I'm a Kirijo. I can't let my feelings tug me around when making these decisions. An agreement between two parties, such as marriage, takes careful consideration. My parents' marriage was arranged for strategic reasons, but as time passed, they slowly grew to honestly love each other. I don't think they were unhappy with their lives. 
Love can take many different forms. Am I wrong about this? speak with my father one last time, I would ask him directly. <laughs> Looks like we ended up staying until closing time. In the library. <laughs> I'm not setting a very good example as student council president. We should go. I think this is exactly... Does it let me do something and then something else happens? That's a bit weird. Is Junpei the only option? Oh, Jesus. I'm not gonna freaking do this with Junpei because if I do it with Junpei, it's gonna mess up my freaking things that I have. So I might as well just do this. Still hold on. Wait, what am I... What am I... Uh, actually, yeah. Let's, let's, let's go check this out first. Da down, 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 down. Uh, oh, hold on. Let me check. Uh, Persona Black Frost is a character. Yeah, might as well. Again, I really wish I had concentrate. Actually, should have done that with. Damn it. Whatever, it's fine. just ended up here somehow. It's so strange. The sky and the ground look all weird, and there's no one around. <sighs> Something bad's happening right now. But for some reason, I feel at peace. Have you forgotten? What? This is the dark hour. Ordinary people shouldn't be free to roam about. You. You've adapted to it somehow. Too well for a human. <sighs> I finally understand. That's why I feel this way whenever you are around. You are dangerous. You are my enemy. Your enemy? Enemy. That's right. It was on a night like this, with the full moon. It was a long time ago. Yes. We've met once before. You and I were enemies. Who... am I? Who are you? I am Igis, the last of the anti-shadow suppression weapons. I was created to destroy shadows. Created to destroy? And you... your true name is Death. You are the shadow I sealed away ten years ago. Shadow? Everyone knew me as death. But when I 
came into being, a part of my power was broken off and scattered. I wasn't at my full strength back then. I was incomplete. Even so, your power was still far too great. I get it. I understand now. I remember everything. I know exactly who and what I am. Palladium! Don't be foolish, I guess. You can't win. I'm even stronger than before. The machine is created to serve a specific purpose. I will destroy you. That is my only reason for existing! It doesn't have to be that way, I guess. You know, uh, did, did something happen? Yukari, what's the matter? Well, I realize it's a full moon tonight. You did too, huh? Oh God, I'm turning into a workaholic. <sighs> Wait, is something actually going on? We're not certain of anything yet, but we can't find Igus. Where could she have gone? At one point, I was able to sense a persona, but I lost Igus right after that. You sensed a persona? Could it have been Straka? Well, she hasn't detected any of them, but we can't be positive. I pinpointed her location. The Moonlight Bridge! All right, call the others. Let's see what's going on over there. I'm sorry. I... I... remember everything. I remember who I am. Who he is. Leader, I know why I wanted to be by your side. I'm sorry. I failed. I'm... sorry. You have no reason to apologize. You? Yoshikun? Wait, what are you doing here? I guess. What is going on? It's all my fault. You did this? Hold on, Akihiko. He's not showing any signs of aggression. Now tell us, who or what are you? Turns out, a 
I'm not so different from the creatures you call shadows. You're a shadow? I'm more than just an ordinary shadow. I'm the appraiser, born from the union of the Twelve Arcana. The appraiser? I remember everything now. The terrifying truth about the shadows and about me. I can't. It's all so hard to believe. You know the truth about the shadows? I do. What? The shadows are here to facilitate the rebirth of the maternal being. As for the appraiser, it draws the maternal being to it, allowing her to awaken. And the appraiser? That's you? That's right. His maternal being? What is it? She's on a level of her own. No words in our language can describe her. Ten years ago, a man collected hordes of shadows and contained them in a laboratory. That's where I was born. But the unification was interrupted, and I awoke before I was complete. After that, Igis took me down, and I returned the favor. Igis? Is this for real, Ryoji? She knew she couldn't destroy me completely, so out of desperation, she sealed me within a child who just happened to be nearby. That child grew up carrying me inside him, and by some twist of fate, he later made his way back here. He even transferred to your school. A transfer student? You don't mean... That's right. I've lived inside him for a long time. His persona awakened, the Twelve Shadows did as well, all in order to become one with me. Ryoji, you're the appraiser? And you were inside of him? Who the hell do you expect us to just believe all that? That's all my fault. I'm sorry, but there's more I need to tell you. Ryoji-kun! He's completely worn out. Let's let him rest for now. Igus needs us too. We'll pick up where we left off after that. Alright, that was a pretty lengthy section of just uh, dialogue where I didn't speak at all. But, oh! He's awake now. Okay, I guess I'm shutting up again. Bye! Tonight on the fourth floor. Got it. Alright, I'll see you then. Damn you, Ryoji. Looks like we're all here. Are you okay, ryoji -kun? Yeah, I'm okay. Thanks. Besides, I have more to tell you guys. Ryoji-kun. Then allow me to jump right in. We have many questions that need answers, after all. Yesterday, you said the Shadows were here to facilitate the rebirth of the maternal being. Tell us more about this. What happens if she returns? The maternal being is called Nyx. Who the hell's Nyx? Nyx is the mother of shadows. In ancient times, she bestowed death upon this world. If she awakens, the world will be swallowed by darkness, and all life will perish. All life? Are you saying everyone will die? 
It'd be more accurate to say that we'll all surrender the will to live. Wait, are, are you talking about the lost? from happening, right? <sighs> what? Don't tell me there's nothing we can do. I'm sorry. Wait, why are you apologizing? Are you saying there's no way to stop it? That's right. You heard the bell. That's when it was all decided. I'm the appraiser. The appraiser of death. The fact that I'm here at all proves the fall is coming. The fall is coming? next spring that's barely any time at all <sighs> what are you guys freaking out about Nick Schmix am I right all we gotta do is win and we're golden and we haven't lost a single fight yet have we against Nyx, power doesn't mean a thing. It's like trying to fight the inevitable, like death or the flow of time. Nyx can't be defeated. She just can't. What? This is bullshit! This is all so sudden. I was born from a collection of shadows. But now, I have a human form, so I can talk with you, laugh with you, cry with you. It's the gift I received for existing within him, and because of that, I can give you a choice. A choice? Nix's arrival is unavoidable now, but you can choose to live in peace until she arrives. You just have to kill me. If the appraiser disappears, all recollection of the dark hour would go with me, and that would erase any memories of this hopeless reality. There'd be no way for you to remember anything. When the fall comes, it'll happen in an instant. You won't have to suffer at all. We'll forget everything? I'm saying you can go back to your normal lives, and by doing that, you might buy a little time and delay the fall, too. Technically, I'm the same as Nyx, so I can't be killed. But thanks to him, there's a part of me that's become human. So if it's done by his hand, then it may be possible. Ryuji-kun... If you don't kill me, everything will stay just as it is. With no hope for salvation, You'll live every day paralyzed by the fear of your impending death. And I don't want to put you through something like that. Exactly. I mean, forgetting all this would be like trying to hide from the truth. Is that really such a bad thing? If you don't do this, all that awaits is despair greater than you can possibly imagine. You don't understand the terror of certain death. Don't make your decision without at least thinking about it first. Uh, why is this happening? You don't have to decide right now. There's still some time. December 31st, New Year's Eve. 
You have until then to think about it. After that, I'll dissolve into the blackness of the dark hour and lose my physical form. Yachi. When Nyx arrives, I'm going to disappear anyway. So please, don't worry about me. I'll be back when New Year's Eve rolls around. Ryoji-kun's presence vanished just now. There's no point in chasing him. He's gone. <laughs> Ryoji-kun. I guess... he'll be back. Alrighty then, uh, can we do anything? Uh, yeah, we can do that, that's fine. So, obviously, um, the correct choice if you want the true ending of the game is to not kill Ryo Ryoji and then having to fight Nyx at the end. Well, you fight Nyx's avatar, you fight Nyx's avatar, rather. Um, but, yeah, that's how you would get the, uh, what is basically, like, the true ending of the of this game. There's not really, like, a, a true ending like there is in Persona 4, Persona 5 in Persona 3. It's just kind of, like, bad ending, good ending, and that's it. And then you have episode, I guess, that happens post-game, um, which used to be called The Answer, but... Anyway, hey. just gonna go ahead and do this now. That's right. So, there you are. Mm. Feeling down today, kid. Mind listening to what this old monk has to say? Those folks downstairs, they're probably around your age, huh? It looks like they're having fun drinking and dancing, but you look closely. Their eyes say otherwise. I bet they come here to relieve stress from the day. But I wonder if any of them are actually enjoying themselves. Stress won't go away unless you deal with the root of the issue. You can put it off, but it'll always come back. This place is more of a refuge than a club to me. Those kids really want to relax. We should switch the music to the Heart Sutra. And... Hey! There's a microphone over there. Bring it over, kid. I'll perform a live sutra reading. Don't underestimate me, kid. My reading of the Heart Sutra will change your life. But I guess you're right. This place is too small to recite it properly. I've got a kid around there. One and only son. He'll be 21 this year. He's a little older than you. He's alive, that is. Alrighty then. Nope, still, I forget. You think it's okay to leave the future of this country in the hands of these kids? I mean, what if they all end up like me? Well, it ain't like I got high hopes for the future. Form is emptiness. Emptiness is form. Oh, sorry. I'm done talking now. Go home before it gets too late, all right? We'll see you next time.
All right. Okay. What rumors do we have today? Some people saying the apathy syndrome is nothing to worry about. Yeah, exactly. They're saying it puts people at oh, Ryan, I forgot about that part. It's kind of new religion. Oh, Jesus. What? Well, at least this one's somewhat smart. That one at least has common sense. Okay, options. What are they? Uh, Mitsuru Kirijo is still an option. Therefore, therefore, I'm gonna continue to hit the wrong damn button over and over again. Mitsuru! Hello. I have to get her to 10 as soon as possible. I wanna do the same with Igis, but. It's so simple. You just purchase a ticket at the window and then walk in to enjoy a film. I'm sorry, have you never been out of the dorm before? Wait a minute, no, wait, 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 hold on a minute, this isn't your first time in a movie theater, we went to the movie theater with you during the film festival, so what are you talking about? Why are you, why are you saying this, like it's some sort of crazy revelation or something? <sighs> this may sound silly to you, but I've always wanted to try the whole theater experience. Did we not go to a movie with Mitsuru during the film festival? sat at the end of the aisle, I didn't feel that my view was compromised in the least. It seems a lot of thought goes into the design and construction of a movie theater. It's thanks to you. I've never felt comfortable enough to come here alone. I'm sure most people don't consider this to be such a big deal. I imagine someone like Yukari would have no reservations seeing a movie by herself. She's likely more suited to riding a motorcycle than I am as well. Yes, you must have seen it when I rode in to provide support for the team. However, that wasn't my original motivation for getting it. With a motorcycle, I can go where I want, when I want, all on my own. You could say it's my modest attempt at rebellion against the many restrictions of my life. After it was damaged, I considered letting go, but ultimately I decided to have it repaired instead. I don't regret that. Even now, I spend my time tuning it whenever I can. Don't mind that. That's nothing. Together? Just the two of us? Can you ride one on your own? Or do you plan to cling on behind me? <laughs> Whichever it is, you've got your work cut out for you. In any case, you have my thanks. I'm feeling a lot better now. went through stressful times maybe they had moments like this too sorry i know this isn't the proper place to stand around chatting but if it's all right with you why don't we stay here a bit longer before heading back Okay. Uh. Okay. Is there literally nothing? What? Hold on. There's something here, though. Why does Why does that not show up? I hate when that not doesn't show up. Wait, oh no. I guess it's still. Yeah. Right. So. Um. I guess we're gonna do this again. We're what? Thirty-five-ish minutes in. Thirty. Thirty-four. Fifty. So yeah. Five minutes in. Huh? You're late. What kept you, huh? Don't you think it's rude to make someone wait? Didn't Dad tell you not to do that? 
don't know what to answer with here. I don't know whether to play along with it or not. Um, we'll go with this. What? I thought you got in a drop dead somewhere or something. Don't make me worry like that. Where the hell are you wandering around? It's late. A friend, huh? Girl? It's a girl, ain't it? <laughs> Even though you're still sponging off your parents? <laughs> well, like father, like son, I guess. Uh, mm. You! What, what the... All this time, I thought you were... I guess my eyesight is getting bad after all. Birthdays. I wonder if they felt the same way I did. I was waiting for you earlier. My wife and son. We were all together back when I was still a businessman. It's already been four years. Hold on a minute, this thing froze. Hold on, I apologize. I didn't even realize. Hold on, I'll pause. We'll be and we're back. I literally paused for less than two seconds and it immediately fixed itself. Sorry about that. What are we talking about today? Did you hear about Mochi? Oh, uh, his parents got transferred because he won't be around anymore. What? Yep. No, well, that's not exactly true, but I wonder how he got all of that. So, well, I imagine he could just snap his fingers and probably change everyone's thoughts. Uh. Oh, my ankle. That kind of hurt. You know, as long as the game just keeps allowing me to do this. Yes. There's only one option. <laughs> I'm sorry to drag you along on this personal venture. section made me realize something. There are so many books about romance, but far fewer on the domestic life that comes after it. I wonder if that means the most exciting time in one's life.
Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. That was the first freeze we've had in like two or three episodes. That is unfortunate. Does everyone go into marriage with the expectation of losing something? The truth is, the group is in turmoil over the inheritance issue. And some of the older members are of the opinion that a student like me isn't up to the task. But I'm the daughter of the head of the group. I need to show that I can take the lead, even if I have to make sacrifices to do it. Fiance has been chosen for me. He's the new president of one of our affiliates, and he's much older than me. But if I agree to the marriage, the future of the company will be secured. He's planning to announce the partnership and our engagement at the same time. Doing so. So, of course, now is when OBS decides to start being a pain in the ass. I don't know why, but it has. It's been working perfectly, and nothing has changed. So I do not understand it. But anyway... This is the best solution for everyone involved. This was decided a long time ago. It's just going to take place a bit sooner than originally planned. That's all. This is... for the best. My mother and father walked the same path, so I won't run from my fate. Uh, you shouldn't make promises you can't keep. What could you possibly do? Still, though, hearing you say that almost makes me want to believe. Listen, lady, I'm the protagonist. I can do what I want. It's literally as easy as just getting Akihiko to threaten a few people. <laughs> I think that'll work. Damn, if Shinji were still alive, that'd probably work really well. Damn. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, they're, they're afraid of Mitsu herself. Honestly, if somebody's not afraid of Mitsu, um, somebody needs to check them in a lab because their survival instincts are not working properly. Say, recently I've been feeling a little hesitant about meeting up with you like this. I already made the decision to carry out my duty, but whenever I talk with you, my resolve begins to falter. Why do I feel this way when I'm with you? <laughs> I think it would be best if we left off here for today. Sorry to do this after inviting you out here, but I need to head home and go over some paperwork on the partnership. Excuse me. Now I'm just keeping my eye on OBS to make sure nothing goes wrong. So I'm like incredibly close to my computer because if you don't know how OBS works, OBS is, uh, it has like a whole bunch of things at the bottom and then you get like a fairly small screen of what, uh, what your actual gameplay would look like. And, um... No. So it's, it's kind of hard to see sometimes. Especially if you're- if I'm looking at my TV, it's like my TV is to the left of my laptop, which I'm using to record because I do not have enough space for a, uh, for a full-on PC. Uh, but anyway. Let's go talk to President Tanaka here. He's rank what now? Rank 8, I think? He's now- oh, wow, so we're gonna get him to 10 here? Damn, our first rank 10! Our first rank 10 is Tanaka. Jesus. <laughs> I've decided to make a donation. They're raising money to help uh, orphans in foreign countries. Uh, don't get the wrong idea. I'm not doing this out of the goodness of my heart. It's a long-term investment. Children who learn to cope with adversity are more likely to become rich and famous, like me. I'm thinking of donating 10 million yen. Uh, not a corporate donation, but a private one. But when I told them over the phone, they sent me this. The 
received it the very next day. Guess I can't back out now. Ten million yen is nothing to me, though. Once those children grow up and become successful, I'll introduce myself to them. I'll say, I'm the one who made all this possible. Then I'll be well taken care of in my old age. If it wasn't for our conversations, I probably wouldn't have considered this. By talking to you, I seem to have developed an interest in watching others mature. I thank you for that. Actually, mm, I should be thanking myself for so wisely taking note of this. Oh, I just remembered that uh, I actually have to pretty much speak during this part. You know what? Let me also lower the volume a little bit. Uh, yeah, just there is fine for right now. Because for some reason, apparently, um, the song that plays during these little sections of this are uh, likely to get copyrighted for some reason. I don't know why, but they are. I really hope it doesn't happen because I don't think I have enough time to reprocess a video today. Maybe, I don't know. Let's hope not, though. Oh, boy. Nice. Oh, okay. You can keep that letter. Ten million yen. I worked myself to the bone for that money. And all I have to show for it is that piece of paper. But... It's not a bad feeling. I'll be going now. A paparazzi could be anywhere. If any one of them were to find out, my brilliant plan would be ruined. Oh, uh, by the way, about that exclusive modeling contract, I've decided to pass on that deal. Or rather, it's your fault for sending me mixed messages. Anyway. Quit associating with shady middle-aged men like me, and find what truly makes you happy. Bye forever. <laughs> Alrighty then. Uh, options, 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 options. What are options? What are our options? Let's go ahead and do this, dude. He's close to ten, I think, at this point. At eight, yeah. Nice. Thank you. So, I'd like you to celebrate with me. As of today, I am a free individual. No, not quite yet. Almost, though. I just came from the hospital. They were going to admit me, but it's no longer needed. I guess my body is too weak to undergo surgery. So I've opted out of examinations and medication. I'm done with the hospital. Now, I'm just waiting for the end, but I don't feel like I'm being singled out anymore. Everyone is waiting to die all the same. Some just have longer to wait than others. But once the time comes, it's the same for all of us. I'm still a little lonely, but I've moved past the sadness. Could I get a better look at you? I want to remember your face.
the story is almost done. So I'll show it to you soon. I'll come see you again. Alrighty then. Uh, options, 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 options. Oh, damn it. Why do we always hit the wrong button? Always, always too much in a rush. I need to slow down for once. There's so many things to do, so many things to see, dude. this for an excuse we never filed for divorce and I've got some pretty good real estate now that I've inherited this temple it's not a bad deal got enough money that I can retire and just enjoy the rest of my life what do you think I gotta find out where they are. I'll hire a detective. I don't care how much it costs. And when I see him, first thing I'm gonna do is tell him I'm sorry. The bottom of my heart. Uh, I'm gonna be concentrating on them, so probably won't be seeing you anytime soon. Well, I'm glad this is it. One brat is all I can handle at a time. And I've gotta deal with my own son now. I never would have become a monk. I guess I'll go to a detective agency tomorrow. Alright, let's get going, kid.
morning. Why does everyone always sound so depressed when they say good morning? Jesus! Yeah. I understand the bomb that Ryoji dropped, but come on. When I heard that for the first time, I was like, eh, we'll be fine. Oh, jeez, and they have to worry about exams right before, too. God, they don't get a break. Uh, what is the name of the stratospheric layer of molecules comprised of free oxygen atoms? Lady... <laughs> you couldn't have freaking asked that question in a different way that made sense to the average human being? My foot fell asleep. <laughs> We're, what, 56 minutes in? 50, 57, pretty much, actually. <laughs> of course! Of course she's the only one available! <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're doing that for the last thing of today's video. <laughs> hey, Mitsuru, how you doing? now, you know. <sighs> Do you remember when I told you I was hesitant to meet up with you like this? I'd like it if you could forget I ever said that. We both sleep under the same roof. There's no point in stressing over it. And besides, I just need to steal my resolve. Say, I have just one favor to ask. Could you continue to show me new places like this? Just until graduation. I'd like to see more of this world that I've been so blind to. Or... Is that too selfish a request? Thank you. Let's make some wonderful memories with what little time we have left. You've taught me so many new things. Whether you're taking command in battle or just talking with me like this. As long as I have these memories for you. I'll be all right. Or so I hope. I forget when, so it would be rank seven, rank eight, Mother, nine, okay, nine. The day is still young. You promised me your time. I'd like you to make good on that now. made a decision. We're gonna fight to the very end! <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Anyway, uh, so I guess we will end today's episode here. Yeah! Uh, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please share the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell icon so you get notified when I make a new video. I open a new video every single day of the week at 5.30 p.m. EST. For today's question of the day, let's do, do you prefer, uh, Full Moon, Full Life, which is the opening for the main game, or I believe it's Disconnected is the name for the, uh, opening for, for episode, I guess? Uh, let me make sure of that for a second here. Uh, Disconnected. Yeah, it's Disconnected, Persona 3, yeah. So, Full Moon, Full Life, or Disconnected, which one do you prefer? Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on the next episode of Persona 3 Reload.